Hi, welcome to my channel. It's Donnell. I got my July Manny by Me subscription box from Maniology yesterday, and so I just wanted to go ahead and just do a quick, a quick, a quick reveal. I've taken everything out the box and opened a couple things already just to speed up the process. So the subscription box always come with a theme. This one is Bubble Pop, and it always comes with these really nice cards. It gives a brief summary, tells you about the theme, tells you about the plates and the stamping polishes that come with it. The full subscription box comes with the early access polishes, a free gift, which is this nail stand and two exclu exclusive plates. Um, you can purchase the express kit for cheaper and it comes with the two exclusive plates, the free gift, but does not come with the polishes. The polishes are early release, so they will be available on the website the following month, usually. Um, so this one is called Bubble Pop, and they always come with a inspiration card, and they give you a manicure how-to. This one's called Bubble Burst. You can see that. And then they give you a step-by-step -step instruction on how to do it to get the same look. So that's that one. All right. And they always come with a sticker. I think this is number three of this one. So, but it's still beautiful. Maybe I'll give that to a friend or something. And then it comes with the two early release polishes. And I will swatch them in just a second. But we have Bliss 518, which is this beautiful lavender and Euphoria B519, which is a white duochrome with a aqua blue-green shimmer. I'm reading it off of the card right here. And the plates. Oh, and just real quick, the free gift is this little nail stand and these nail tips and they're glittery. I really like this. I was excited to see it. I have lots of nail stands and lots of tips, but I don't have this one. I like Okay, moving on to the plates. They should come with like a little pull tub. All right, now that that's off. So again, the theme is bubble pop. Sorry about the reflection. Can't be helped when you're dealing with shiny surfaces. I'm not a professional, so this is not a professional studio. Anyway, bubble pop, Maniology MXM 131. So cute, so, so cute. You have a little girl right here blowing bubbles. Don't burst my bubble, feeling bubbly. Uh, put your troubles in a bubble and blow it away. <laughs> I like that. Um, and then we have all of these different like bubble collages and then the individual bubble wands and everything. I really like these over here. I like them all, but I, I just really like these. And then we also have many... Blah, 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 blah. Maniology MXM 132. And that's kind of like a chandelier effect. And then you have all the little bubble animals. This one says in my own bubble. More bubbles, less trouble. I like the in my home bubble. That's me. And then you have all these little bubble images and they're really cute. Bubble heart is really cute. I know there's been a lot of um, debate over, is it a giraffe, llama, alpaca? What is it? It's whatever you want it to be. I mean, giraffes don't really have that short of legs, but neither do cats, right? So add some little yellow or orange squares and you can have a giraffe. Add whatever you want. Make it whatever you want. Put cow print on it. Make it cute. I like these too. I like them all. They're all super cute. So let's see what we got. I always forget about my squeaky chair until I start doing a video. I swear it doesn't squeak until I'm sitting here. Get an old 
Oops. A stamper. So somebody had pointed out in another video as well that the labels were different, that they were glossy. And I can see that this one is glossy. It's a glossy sticker and this one is matte. So that's interesting. So I am going to use one of these designs to swatch with. I think I'll just do the bubbles just to get an all over coverage. So we'll do B158 first. Real quick. And the other one isn't going to show up really well because it's a special effect stamping polish it's the duochrome and they tend to be a little bit harder to see i'll just do these little hearts on some tips all right so I have a black a black swatch stick here and I'm just gonna do the hearts oh wait I just did those that's not gonna work I don't think I'm gonna try it anyway but it's not gonna work oh it did work So you can see that green shimmery color. Well, maybe you can see it. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but I can see it in person. And then let's do this. Bliss the purple. This is so pretty. It's cute. Oops, sorry. Like in your face. It's a really nice one as well. And then so you can see it as a base. A really nice lavender light purple this one i'm still i'm gonna swatch it because i have everything swatched but it's not really gonna do much over clear except be a beautiful pearlescent shimmer See the shimmer? Shimmer, shimmer. Really nice, really pretty. Let's stamp the purple over white. I'm trying to decide which design I wanna use. I think we're gonna do a little heart. God, that was a lot of polish. One of my roosters outside, he's a younger one, and he's he just learned to crow, and he sounds a little broken. It's like, <laughs> it's awful. So there's the purple, oops, sorry, the bubble hearts. And I'm not, I don't really want to stamp this one on the white because, again, that's just kind of a waste. So there you go. 
hairs and the different looks. Super cute, super nice polishes. A really cute set. Again, um, some people compared this to the, um, I'm just cutting a piece of cotton ball that unraveled, compared this to the uh, cloud plate. And it is similar. Um, but it's bubbles, not clouds, so similar doesn't mean the same, and it doesn't mean bad. I cannot find this acetone; it's just about empty. So I like it. I think it's cute. I think it's different. Bliss and Euphoria, cream lavender, and a duo white duo chrome with a aqua green. Uh, 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 shimmer, that's the word I'm looking for, shimmer. So, and completely off the subject, but I just knocked it over. And so I just wanted to show how cute this was. My husband recently went on a um, hiking backpacking trip in Europe across Spain with his best friend. And he always brings me back like some little trinket. And he bought me, he bought me this like snow globe with a witch in it, on a little skull. And you can see the castle with the bones, and the witch riding her broom. And this, you know, I I'm like, you would never see it from the outside, but I'm a spooky kind of girl. I love everything spooky and witchy magic all that kind of stuff so it's a tiny little snow globe i mean like it fits in my hand it's adorable it's so cute i love it and he's always so thoughtful he always gets something that's like he knows is gonna make me laugh or smile so really cute i really like that so anyway thanks for watching Stay tuned, subscribe, so you can get notified whenever I upload new nail hauls, unboxing videos, and manicures, and maybe some how-tos coming soon. Until next time, bye.